dollars a barrel. There you go. Good oh. Well, you know what? Let's check in with Tim this morning to see what he is up to and where he is. Something a little different for you this morning, gang. It's been a very busy morning here. We've had about 300 cows get on this Lazy Susan and basically dance their way around as they are milked. We this morning are waking up in the Atherton Tablelands. I'll tell you more about that right after I tell you a little bit more about our weather. And having a look at our country today, we are free of mostly heavy cloud and storm systems. That's thanks to a massive high that is sitting across our southeast. Uh, we will see largely clear skies, but that is going to mean there are some very chilly overnight lows right now in our major capitals along the east coast. We are all in the single digits. Let's take a closer look at our temperatures for this Wednesday today. And you can expect in Queensland some partly cloudy conditions in the tropical north. 27 degrees for Cairns. Mostly sunny everywhere else. Partly cloudy though around Hamilton Island. And then as we move further south, the Sunshine Coast heading south towards Brisbane and the Gold Coast. Partly cloudy conditions. To New South Wales we go and a partly cloudy day for Grafton ahead. There will be lots of morning frost around uh, Tamworth and Dubbo, Broken Hill and Orange as well, Wagga Wagga and Albury, but that should clear off for mostly fine conditions. Sunshine by the coast in Newcastle and Gosford. Canberra, you can expect a morning frost clearing for sunshine atop of 13 degrees right now. It is minus two. Let's take a look at Victoria for you and mostly cloudy conditions across Victoria after a light frost today and we can expect to see uh, a cloudy top of 12 degrees for Ballarat and taking a look at Tasmania, partly cloudy conditions for both Launceston and Swansea. Some showers around today for storm. Let's go to South Australia now. Partly cloudy for both Mount Gambier and Port Lincoln. Fine conditions for Sejuna and Coober Pedy today. To Western Australia we head. Partly cloudy conditions in the southwest of the state. Mostly sunny for Kalgoorlie. Otherwise looking fine and sunny uh, for Gerald and Carnarvon, Caratha and Port Hedland. A very hot one for Broome today. 38 degrees and looking fine. And to the Northern Territory finally sunny and 35 degrees. Alice Springs looking fine for you and a top of 30 one. Well, my cameraman is a lot braver than I. Wayne Hylard caps off to you because, oh my goodness, he is in the danger zone. Not only are these cows being milked, they are also um, having a bit of a clean out first, first thing this morning. It's quite something to behold. Um, as I said, around 350 cows jump on to this um, spinning circle. They're amazing the way they just march themselves in and when a spot becomes available, they just take themselves on in and then when they spin around, it takes about seven minutes. There's a water cannon on the other side that when it taps them on the head, they back themselves out and they're done for the day. You can expect that they uh, will get around 20 litres of milk from each cow um, here this morning and put that all together here at the Gallo Dairyland. Goodness me, not only do you have some fine top quality milk, but you're also going to get some great cheeses and chocolates. And this morning, we're going to sample the lot of it, guys. It's going to be a fun one. It sure reminds me of the breast pump. <laughs> That's for sure. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, it gets so full in the morning. <laughs> It's true. It's thank you, Abby, our floor okay. manager. It's, tr it's just the truth, I speak. <laughs> the truth is <laughs> Not that much. Just, just, just to see that shot as you said it, though. Anyway, coming up this Wednesday, relief of